Okay, we're set. Our entire lives are defined by the image, and certainly the best way of getting those images through the camera. Whether we go back to 1839, when the first practical photographs were being made, uh, all the way up to the present, uh, everything that we know about the world, everything we know about ourselves and our friends and our culture are defined by the image. My name is Carol Cook, and I have a passion for photography. I was taking pictures just with a little Insomatic camera in high school, but it, it wasn't necessarily a passion, so to speak. I guess when I finally got to college and started in a course that gave me some parameters, some ideas, I think that's when I got bitten by the bug. So I was teaching at Towson High School and I heard that Andy Warhol was going to be doing a book signing in Georgetown outside of D.C. So I actually took a couple of students. We went down on a Saturday, stood in line. Uh, the store opens and uh, Warhol has got his entourage on either side. Everyone's carrying, I guess, memorabilia or whatever for him to sign and also to purchase a book that he was releasing at that point. Um, and I walked up, he was actually signing uh, an interview magazine that he had published for me and I, I just said, Mr. Warhol, can I take your photograph? Well, he just looked up at me <laughs> and then just held that pose and it was like something inside me said, take the picture, hurry, quick. <laughs> so I snapped the shot and yeah, I guess I can say that I met Andy Warhol. So I've been teaching photography in 41 years, if you can believe that. Size, your proximity to so, it. Just a little too much. In terms of traditional photography, there's obviously more of a gamble just because of the, um, the technology or the processing itself. The digital age, so much is done for you, but with film and developing and processing, there are many different uh, opportunities to make mistakes. If I have a roll of film, I have 24 opportunities to go out and get a good shot. With a digital, you have countless, limitless, you know, depending on the size of your card. I guess the main thing that I really enjoy about traditional photography is that it's very hands-on, very tactile. Um, it is about uh, using, you know, equipment. It is about uh, problem solving in terms of how things work um, and how to uh, make the best possible image that you can. So, it's, it's a rather simple process. The simplicity of the process itself is really dependent upon how good your negative is. Because if the negative itself uh, is not a well-exposed negative, then the positive will present any variety of, uh, I guess, problems. You know, I don't want to say more defined by the still image as opposed to the moving image but uh, still the single image captures a brief second, a split second. Um, and those are moments that we can never regrasp. Uh, you know, photography defines me, defines my world, uh, defines everything I know about my life.